Here we have 7.1 solving a quadratic equation using the square root property, exact answers basic. So square root property tells us if we take the square root on both sides, we get plus or minus over here with on this side without the variables. So we get the square root of 24. Now 24 can be written as 4 times 6. And the square root of 4 is 2. The square root of 6 cannot be simplified. So we get two answers, 2 square root of 6 and negative 2 square root of 6. In the second example, if we take the square root on both sides, um, we get x equals plus or minus the square root of negative 18. The negative will come out as an i, 18 is 9 times 2, the, which means you'll get x equals plus or minus i, the square root of 9 is 3, and the square root of 2 cannot be simplified. So you get 3i square root of 2 and negative 3i square root of 2. Now if the problem only asks you for real solutions, these are imaginary solutions. If the problem asked you for real solutions, your response would just be no real solutions. So be very careful as to whether they use this phrase, find the real solutions or find all solutions. It makes a difference.